I'm Anne from Game Like a Mother. Today I'm going to show you how to play Avocado Smash. It's ages six and up, two or more players, and it takes 10 minutes. Let me show you how to play. The goal of the game is to be the first player to get rid of all of your cards. And you get rid of your cards by not being the last person to slap out in the center. And I'll show you how that works. To set up, everyone is dealt an equivalent number of cards. This is a three player game we have set up here. And you pick somebody to go first and they start by flipping a card out. Usually when you play a speed game, you, you loosely hold the cards in your hand and then you flip it out away from you in, in the middle. And in this game, you say uh, one avocado to start. Each person, as they play a card, counts up until you get to 15. So they'd say one avocado, two avocado, three avocado, and so on until you get to 15 and then you restart and go back to one if you haven't um, smashed anything by that by then. The purpose of the numbers is if the number you say and the card you flip out. So if you say four avocado, then it's a smash and everyone tries to slap in on that. And whoever in a group of three, whoever is the last to smash uh, uh, would collect the card. So we'll say this person uh, was the last. If that happens, you put the cards in the bottom of your stack and then you reveal another card and you start over by saying one avocado and you start another round of play. Uh, there are other opportunities to smash in addition to that. Uh, if they had, here, we'll get those cards out again. So instead of playing a four, if instead of playing a four, they had played another seven out on the other person, that's a pair. And anytime there's a pair of any cards, even specialty cards, that's a smash. And then everybody would slap in and whoever is, it doesn't matter if you're in the middle of the pile or if you're first, it's whoever is the last person to slap in, then they would collect those cards. So this person would start again, one avocado, and then it's this person's turn, two avocado, there are also smash cards. If that happens, you smash. So everybody slaps in and whoever is the last person, uh, we'll say this person is really struggling this time, they would collect the cards. There are also, uh, we'll say it's this player's turn, they say one avocado. Uh, when we play this, sometimes we just say the numbers instead of saying one avocado, two avocado, three avocado. It gets to be a mouthful. It's up to you if you want to say the full thing or just go one, two, three, four. Uh, in addition uh, to another specialty card to look for is the change direction cards. And in a two player game that has no impact, but if it's uh, two or more, if it's more than two players, then it switches the direction, but only for the rest of the round. So they would have said one avocado, they would have said two avocado, then it's back to this player and they would say three avocado, play would proceed uh, unless they get another switch direction card and then that would switch the direction back. Or if you have two in a row, it's a specialty card, um, but you have two of them in a row, so it's a pair, so you would smash on that. And then the only other specialty card to take into account is we are up to three avocados. They would say four avocado. <gasps> Guacamole cards are special. You do not smash these. Uh, instead, everyone shouts out guacamole. Whoever says it last collects the cards unless someone accidentally smashes this. So if this person shouts out guacamole and this person shouts out guacamole, but this person accidentally slaps. It doesn't matter that this person said guacamole second. Uh, this person, whoever touches it, would then collect the cards and start the next round. The first player to run out of cards is the winner, but they are only declared the winner if they survive the next smash. So you would continue playing until there's something else to smash, to slap on, and then if they weren't the last player to slap in on it, they would win. Uh, if two players ran out of cards at the same time, 
the first of those to smash correctly would win. And they make sure that it's really a big deal in this game to have correct form and flip the cards out away from you, not any of this business, uh, so that it is fair and everyone sees the cards at the same time. So that's how to play Avocado Smash. If you love speed games like Taco Cat, Goat Cheese Pizza, then you will love this. So check it out. Thanks and see you next time from Game Like a Mother.